Court. As you know, he represents the family. I'm his senior public policy advisor, and like Trey said, the home girl. But can I preach for just a moment? Yeah. I need a few of you to stand up. We're doing too much sitting down. Because somebody didn't get shot in the face. Be able to stand. I need you to stand. I need you to know what standing in solidarity looks like and feels like. This ain't no, this ain't no family reunion and sitting down. Somebody need to be standing up so I can get to your spirit. Come on, man. Because it's, it's missing the connection. Come on now. I need you to get. I need you to understand. We had a sister shot in the face. That's right. Come on now. And he already told you they won't have to vote again because they're destroying democracy, replacing it with an autocracy. Again, before we continue, I do want to bring at least two or three mothers up here, two or three sisters, however you want to be labeled. Emma Sutton. It's okay, sister. I have a son that has mental illness. He's 31 years old, and he's been suffering with mental illness for eight years. He has a phobia that he's trying to make himself well and heal by all kind of medications, you know, trying to, but it throws him off. And he calls the police because he thinks somebody done come in the house and stole his medication. He been waiting for years and ain't nobody showed up yet. The question is gonna be asked, were you with the goat or what, or what the sheep? Huh. Now some of y'all mean sheep just going along to get along, and going along, but it's a different type of sheep, Bishop. The sheep to say, did you stand up? The sheep to say, did you go see about the least of this? The sheep that went to the prison. The sheep that opened your mouth when his sister got shot in the face. probably do. AMA Sheila Jackson, rest in peace too. You know, she's on the front line with me too, so we're going to do a moment of silence for both of them on the count of three. One, two, three. May they rest in peace. 